this story. Officer John Branson is never going to forget the spring break that he took last year. So it's April of 2016. He leaves Anderson heading south, and he stops in Georgia at a Cracker Barrel. That's where he meets a man that would change the course of his life. When John Branson goes to work at the Anderson Police Department, he spends his day sorting evidence from a variety of crimes. But Officer Branson has recently seen evidence of a miracle that began at a Georgia Cracker Barrel. Last April, Officer Branson spotted a man wearing a veteran's hat. There was a connection because Officer Branson once served in the Coast Guard, and his son is going into the military. It turns out that man at the Cracker Barrel, Edgar Roberts, was a Purple Heart recipient in Vietnam and now a minister of a Baptist church in Georgia. During their conversation at Cracker Barrel, Officer Branson learned something else. He told me he had uh, issues with his kidney. Uh, he's been on dialysis for five years. Officer Branson and Pastor Roberts became friends. They talked about the pastor's failing kidney. He didn't know how much longer he could hold on. Officer Branson learned they had the same blood type and decided he wanted to become the organ donor. They called me back in five days and said I was a perfect match for a kidney donation for Edgar. Pastor Roberts says he knew God would answer his prayer. He proved that he's still God. He said he was the same God yesterday, same God today. He said, just trust him. And I have to trust him wholeheartedly. I believe in God, and I, I just believe this is his way of working uh, through me for, a, for a, a fellow Christian. If everything goes as planned, Officer Branson and Pastor Roberts will have the transplant surgery in Florida in early May. I just don't have words to express how great I feel and how great my my family feel because going through dialysis is a test, but God gives me the strength to endure. I told him he'll be able to dance a lot better probably when he gets that kidney all set. <laughs> An Indiana officer, a Georgia preacher, about to be connected forever thanks to a chance meeting at Cracker Barrel. The women at that church in Georgia knitted a blanket for the officer to use while he's in the hospital in May. The Anderson police chief is supportive of his police officer who will need several weeks to recover. So one other question here, and this is obviously expensive, how, yeah. how are they going to pay for all this? Well, you're right, John. I mean, they've got the transportation issues going to and from Florida, so they've gone ahead and set up a GoFundMe account mm -hmm. to set up. They're looking for about 5000 bucks to help pay for some of these costs, and we've got that on our WTHR link. Yeah, You've got to get a feeling they'll get it. I think they will. Yeah. What a great story. It's a great I'm rooting story. for both those guys. Uh -huh. Thank you, Scott. Hope you the bet. surgery is a 